You know, I consider Washington local to Baltimore. You know, our, many of our artists come from the D.C. region. Uh, many of our audience come from between here and, and Washington, D.C. And so the fact that uh, Ken Lovewick, the great playwright who lives in the D.C. area, has standing on the shoulders of Thornton Wilder, who's standing on the shoulders of George Farquhar, going back three centuries, uh, may be immediately attracted to the play. When I read it, I couldn't stop laughing, and that's always a sign. You know, when you read something on the page and you're laughing out loud, it's probably something you should bring to the stage. For some reason, it just never sort of rose to the heights of the school for scandals out there or the other famous restoration comedies. I heard that there was this adaptation of it. What happened was one of our giant playwrights, Thornton Wilder, always had an affinity for this play and, and he felt that it should be uh, considered one of the finest restoration comedies out there. And he felt like if he could just tweak the storyline a little bit and focus it a little bit, shorten it a little bit, update some of the language, that it's a hilariously funny play and that audiences would see it for the great play that it is. Unfortunately, that project got tabled in the Wilder estate and approached Ken Lovewood to finish Wilder's adaptation of Farquhar's restoration comedy, which he did magnificently. It's about two bachelors who are out there trying to woo rich women and they go from town to town and in one town one will be the master and the other will be the servant and the next town they flip roles and the whole idea is to hoodwink a, a beautiful rich woman into believing that they're men of means and they marry them and that's how they're going to get rich and you root for them as they go because they actually end up being of course uh, quality men they can't follow through on the scam they fall in love we've hired uh, special experts that will help teach the sword play that happens it's a great epic story This is a perfect season closer. I think it's fitting to wrap up the first season on Fayette Street uh, with laughter, with comedy, with a celebration. The great British American American play. <laughs> In short, the business we call it the Bows. <laughs> it's swashbuckling fun. I love that word. That's my new word.